Hey guys, it, this is Temple Eight Five One, and my and or just call me by my real name, Fabian. Um, sorry guys, I've been not really posting up a lot of blogs lately. I've been pretty much focused on trying to get my school work. In addition to that, I was also trying to focus on working on my new tr working on some new tracks, and also I was trying to work on um, no, no 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 not not say work on but. I've been trying to, I've been dealing with, deal with life basically, so I've, so I'd like to apologize, and also the battery issue is just, um, it, it's running low, so I might have to replace batteries every now and then, so I'd like to apologize for not posting up some video blogs, and I just want to go ahead and just say that, and I also would like to apologize for not posting any shout out some more shout outs I've already made some shout outs in my last video but I like to really truly apologize for not really doing that um not doing that extensively as as in the blog mode so I truly would like to apologize for it um so I just want to go ahead and give you like an update about what I'm doing. Oh, sorry. By the way, all of you Filipino Eyes fans, or Filipino Eyes, nice people, I'm sorry for not posting any blogs either. I'm, I'm really sorry. Uh, I just want to go ahead and share with you some new stuff that I've done. And afterwards, I'm going to go ahead and talk to you about what I've been doing. Okay, I'm sorry. This is the original artwork for the what I did in G1, which is just the <laughs> beginning drawing. No, not beginning drawing. It was just typography. As you can see, that's I did that. I did all the drawings from here. This is this is what I've done in my la done in the last module. Well, actually, done this module. And this is the the one this is the movie poster these two are the movie posters I've done and so far I've done this in Photoshop you can tell that I tell I did it all of it in Photoshop everything <laughs> and this is a marker comp position that I've done and uh, that's not gonna be my portfolio don't squash that this is what I've done for as the final project, the CD cover. As you can tell, this is the Kanye West and Jay Z. That's they're going to be their new album. We're watching the throne. We we had to just do that project. Besides, I don't like I don't like listening to hip hop whatsoever. Not as much. I only yes. I'll take it back. I listen to Notorious B.I.G. and some Tupac, but not a lot of rap. Oh yes, Ice Cube. Yes. I listen to Ice Cube, but the older ones. As you can see, this is a CD cover that I just done. That's that's what I did. And the t-shirt designs and everything else. I'm sorry. I want to go ahead and show you something else. Hold on. Ah, dang it, it's in my car. Crap. But anyway, uh, I want to go ahead and show you my Facebook. Show my Facebook. Okay. All right, this is what I've done. This is the this is the artwork that I've done. I did this. I'm sorry for the sorry for the not clarity issue. I like to apologize for that. So this is what I've done. I originally did it in in my sketchbook, and I scanned it on the computer, and I used Photoshop to go ahead and do some painting. So I pretty much did it in all in layers. I did it all in a glow. The f first layer was pretty much I did it in paint and I just made it re invert that into a glow and then I just put some highlights all over it by matching the colors and I did an adjust so that's what you can see. So that's what I've done. That's my f done. And yes, that's my Facebook. Yes, that's my Facebook. Yes, you can see. Yes, 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 yes. <sighs> anyway, that's that's something else I wanted to show you, but 
that's one of the updates I've done so far. Um, school's been great. School's been fantastic, and so far I've been on an honor roll. But here's kind of the disappointing part. The disappointing part is the fact that I'm the only one in my class who's passing. Well, the other two, they're failing. I mean, that that's that's like that, that just makes me so sad that I'm like the only one who's passing. And there was two black guys, me and the other guy. And there was one Hispanic. And I'm the only one who's passing. I mean that. I mean, it's great that I'm that I'm the one who's working hard. I'm doing it. I'm putting all the work. But it's like all the others they're they're not doing the work. I, well, I know that the Hispanic guy is doing it. I, I know that. I, I know he's been doing that, and I know he has been having a hard time. But, seriously, a lot, those guys miss a lot of stuff, and they're on a, a tennis probation. That's the sad part. So that's kind of what, that's one of the things that kind of make me a bit sad, and I just really don't, I, I just hope they can do it. I just hope they can pull, I just hope they can pull it off. I already know that the 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 other African American guy he missed a lot of days. I think he's gonna have to do a repeat. I mean, I hate to see him not come to G3, which I'm gonna be going to. And I also hate the fact that if David does not come, the Hispanic guy, <coughs> he may not be able to come to G3. So that's gonna be one of the sad things that's going to be happening. So I just have to really tell you that. But there's something else that's also on my mind. Not a lot of people, not a lot of you are really aware of this, but I am, but I am still single. And I have been doing online dating for ever since 2004. And it has been one of the most tough times in my life because I never really had a chance to have meet the girl of my dreams. I had met the girl of my dreams in my previous work, but it never really happened. I mean, she was a she was a very beautiful. I think she was Hawaiian, but she was very cute. But I never really had the chance. But here's the thing for me that I, I know it's like. I don't really ask a girl out in person except for one person who I that I had admire for, but she just decided she wants to be friends, and, and I accepted that. I just wanted her to be friends, and I accepted it bar none, done and done, until she called me the N-word, but use it as a joke, but anyway, I'm sorry, it's hot, actually, um, so... And then here's the thing. I'm not afraid of being alone. I mean, hey, I can, hey, I can live alone. I can be able to handle my, be able to live my life alone. I've pretty much been in my room alone every single time. But I'm more afraid of being alone for the rest. No, of being lonely for the rest of my life. You see, I have been cheated on. I have been screwed on, deceived, and, and for what? I, because I, I, I love them, and yet they do that to me. I mean, I remember in high school, I thought I had a girlfriend. It turns out the girlfriend that I thought didn't really like me at all. She only just wanted me as her friend. And I found out that the letters were written by her other friend who pretended to like me but she got pregnant by some other guy but now got married to him and used me in the process and that wasn't great that was not the best thing that I ever had in my life so seriously I did not like that experience whatsoever so if you're in that type of situation please do not allow anyone to try to take advantage of you because I've been taken advantage of multiple times that made me really sick to this day, and that kind of makes me really think about the people that hurt me. And yeah, there was this one girl who was online, and trust me, she hurt me enough that 
I almost committed suicide. I almost did. Almost had, there was that thought. But I had to stop myself from doing that. So I had to figure out what, what I needed to do. And I pretty much stopped myself from doing that. And yet, she always does the same old stupid things over and over again, but pretending to say that she loves me and wanted to be with me, when in fact, well, she's really not. Seriously. I mean, I hate that. I mean, that was that's completely idiotic that how she did something like that to me. That was completely idiotic that she did something like that. That was, you know, for her to cheat on me and for her to say that because I helped her out. I always helped her out every single day. And that was completely idiot. I was a complete idiot, and that was my fault. But she had to do that to me, and that was stupid. That was wrong. But don't worry, I paid her back, hacked in her Facebook, and pretty much said, just tell her what she did, what she did to me, and what she did, to, and found out that she did it to the same other guys. <laughs> same thing to the other guys. So that was a little my revenge. So... Guys, if you were ever in that situation, it's okay to be mad. It's okay to it's okay to be sad. Because don't worry, karma is going to get them. The karma is going to bite them in their behinds. Trust me. I know she. I know she's going to bite it. Eventually, it's going to eat her soul up, and she's going to wonder why she had a mess with me. But. I'm not gonna, but hopefully she'll get the message and she'll learn not to hurt me again. So, either way, I'm still a loner. I don't have anyone. So, I'm sorry, sorry guys if I'm sweating, but if are there any nice ladies out there on YouTube, don't hesitate to talk to me. Don't hesitate to come to me. Just email me. I'll be happy to respond. You can private message me. You can comment, respond. I don't care. If you're interested, just talk to me. But I am not going to speak to anyone who are scammers. Not again. Not anymore. Alright? Because I'm done. I had enough. So... If you are interested in any way, you can always private message me. I can show you my phone number. We can always talk. We can always do that. You can also add me on my Facebook. I have multiple Facebooks. So, But the one I really used multiply was the one that I showed you with that picture that I've done. So if you see that picture, you know that's me. And if you're interested, just give me a ring. All right, guys? Anyway, just... Take it easy. I hope you guys are doing well. I love you guys. And by all means, subscribe to me. By all means, I'm, I'm posting up new stuff. Don't worry, I'm gonna post up some new stuff. Just, just give me, you know, just, just tell me what you want. Tell me what you guys want me to do. What do you guys want me to do? If you, if you have any suggestions, just blur them out I'll go I'll be happy to go ahead and do that for you and and I'll make sure I'll make that happen all right take it easy guys um, right now I have a I'm sorry I'm sweating I have a presentation I have to do tomorrow that portfolio that I showed you I have to present and then and then I'm on to G3 maybe possibly by myself so anyway, guys, take it easy. This is Temple 851, or my real name, Fabian, and I'm signing off. Take care.